Hey, Nelson Ierson here with High Gear Media. We're at the 2012 Los Angeles Auto Show, and I'm standing in front of the new 2013 Porsche Cayman. This is actually a Cayman S model, which is the more powerful, sportier of the two. But first, let's take a look at the design. Sharing most of its design elements, aside from obviously the hardtop, with the 2013 Porsche Boxster, which we already know and love quite well, the 2013 Cayman is, simply put, a very pretty car. I mean, front to back, it's got all the curves in all the right places. Although, the Porsche purists may look at the rear and say, eh, the Boxster's a little bit prettier. That's all well and good, but stuck in the middle of this car is the 3.4 liter flat six, rated for 325 horsepower, getting this car to 60 miles an hour with the PDK transmission in just 4.6 seconds. That's one quick little two-seater. All right, if your need for speed is a little bit less acute, however, the regular Cayman is good for 275 horsepower from a 2.7 liter flat six engine that still gets to 60 miles an hour in just 5.1 seconds, again, with the seven speed PDK dual clutch transmission. Uh, to be honest, we wouldn't fault anyone for choosing that over the six speed manual, as good as the six speed manual is, because the PDK is simply brilliant. It predicts downshifts, it selects upshifts with no loss, seamless power transition, it's just really excellent on track and it's so convenient and so easy to use around town. Now, you might think, hey, this sounds like the Cayman is pretty much the complete package and guess what, it really is. We haven't driven it yet, but we have every bit of faith that based on our experience with the Boxster, this is going to be perhaps the best all-around car in Porsche's lineup for 2013. All right, starting at about $52,000 for the standard Cayman and moving up to about $63,000 for the Cayman S, this is one expensive but not obscenely expensive, exceedingly pretty, very comfortable and highly useful two-seat sports car. If you're in the market for something that goes fast and looks good, you could do a lot worse than the 2013 Cayman. All right, live from the 2012 Los Angeles Auto Show, I'm Nelson Ierson with High Gear Media.